What is up guys, it's Awana Turtle, so today we are doing another opening of one of these Duelist Saga boxes. These guys are interesting, uh, they kind of have a lot of, not vintage cards, but cards from the various shows. Um, there's nothing too crazy, but there's a lot of pretty cool uh, nostalgic cards, although for me, I where I only kind of like watched the first two series. Um, so I kind of picked I had a couple of these boxes and I picked like... Well, I'm not too familiar with this. Must be like a number numbers, like number ten or something. And then the thing is the Black Rose Dragon. So, uh, versus some of the other ones had more pack arts that I was more familiar with. So I decided to keep those sealed. And I'm going to open up these. I really like this. Kind of how they case this. It's really simple, but it looks looks good in the box. And uh, yeah, keeps the cards nice, protected in my opinion. So we're going to go with three more packs of Duel Saga. <clears throat> you can tell that these are kind of old, like. The cards, since there's only five cards in the pack, is has a little bit too much room, so the cards are kind of warped right off the bat. But it's a pretty cool set. Let's see what we can get this time. Uh, I think the biggest hit I'm looking for right now is the Black Luster Soldier. Here we have a Guard Penguin. That looks pretty cool. White Veil. Oh, there's like a, a, a Veil Effect Veil or something like that. Clear Effector. Brain control. Here's a classic card. Pay 800 life points. Um, face a monster. Yep. And then Castell, the Sky Blaster Musketeer. Interesting. I, I love the foil. I'm not sure what kind of foil this is called, but it's very different. It's not the prismatic. It's not obviously not ultra. It's not secret or anything like that. So let's go with the. I think I believe this is a Black Rose Dragon. Okay, this is a card we pulled last time. Lightwing Shield. Dark Lord Descent. Number 94. Crystal Zero. Ooh, Honest. This is from the GX. I, can't, I think Honest Neos is one of the cards you can pull as well. Ooh, Pot of Duality. This card, not as, uh, I feel like it's not as necessary anymore. Evacuate the top three cards of the deck, then add them to your hand. Also, that shuffle the rest of your hand. Pod duality. <clears throat> I feel like there's just so many different ways of, like, where they took pot. Of, they had pot of greed at first. It's like, all right, we can't have this. So then there's a lot of like just various versions of nerfed uh, pot of greed. Here we have a clashing souls. Not sure what I'm looking at here. Dark Lord Ukoback. Chaos Scepter Blast, that looks pretty cool. Future Fusion, that's clearly a um, Heroes card. Ooh, nice, Dark Magician of Chaos to wrap it up. Definitely a cool pull right there, really happy with that. All right, so yeah, another, another quick opening um, for you guys. And yeah, just a lot of different, it's very different. You know, again, nothing, nothing too crazy. Um, yeah, pod duality, which is nice. Honest, like that. I don't remember who had honest, and then then uh, Yuki Jane ended up using him, and then a guard penguin. This me, just reminds me. Oh, it reminds me of like a Mega Man, <laughs> Mega Man character. Um, so there you guys have it. Very quick opening for you guys. And uh, as always, you do want to support the channel, hit that like button. Uh, hit, hit subscribe if you're not already. And uh, yeah, leave me a comment what your thoughts about this set is. Um, or if there's any other kind of like, ran not random sets, but kind of like one of those side sets where really small and just very different. Uh, let me know if there's anything that you have your eye on that I should uh, look into obtaining to open for you guys. And I'll see what I can do. Uh, on that, guys, that's all we have for today. I'm Moana Turtle, and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace.